the story of the X-Men. The story of the X-Men. Adapted by Thomas Macri. Illustrated by Pat Oliff and Hi-Fi Design. Based on the Marvel comic book series X-Men. Everyone is different. But some people are very different. They don't fit in with others. They are born with powers. They are called mutants. Some people are afraid of mutants. They are afraid of their powers. They are scared of them because they are different. This fear makes these people mean. It makes them angry. They chase mutants away. They don't want them around. This is Charles Xavier. He is a professor. He calls himself Professor X. Professor X dreams of a better world. In this world, humans are nice to mutants. Professor X is a mutant. He can read minds. He wanted to use his gift to make his dream come true. He needed to find other mutants who could help him, too. He met Scott Summers. Scott could shoot beams from his eyes. Professor X called him Cyclops. He found Bobby Drake. Bobby could turn himself to ice. He was called Iceman. Next, the professor met Warren Worthington. Warren had wings like a bird's. He could fly. He called himself Angel. He also found Hank McCoy. Hank could swing and jump. He was like an animal. He called himself the Beast. Jean Grey was the last mutant to join the group. She could move things with her mind. She was called Marvel Girl. Together they formed a team. They were called the X-Men. They were going to fight for Professor X's dream. The X-Men's first battle was against a man named Magneto. Magneto wanted mutants to rule over humans.